Yo, 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 what is up, fam? It's your dude, fan of here, guys. Yesterday, I took a day off. Yesterday, we took a day off, bros. Uh, it was much needed, but now, you know, I, I give myself two days off. Two half days off. I've already given myself two half days. Actually, one half day. Two full days. So, like, you know. <laughs> guys, we're out of days. We're out of days, bro. We're out of days, man. We're legit. We only got a half day left this month, and I've got, like, what? Like, 14, 15 days left in the month. So, yeah. We, we are, uh... We, we need the days off. That's... We just needed the days off, guys. Not gonna lie. Um, hold on, hold on. Yeah, we, um, so yeah, we will, uh, guys, Mr. Beast uploaded, guys. You know, he takes a week off. I didn't, I didn't really hear much on Twitter about, you know, him uploading that much, guys. Like, his potential new videos. I do follow him and stuff, so, but hey, he, he dropped it, he dropped it kind of unexpectedly, at least on my part. I mean, he might make a tw few tweets about it, like, the week it comes and gets uploaded, but, uh, yeah, it just dropped, guys. Didn't really get any hits on Twitter or anything. Let's check it out. Behind me are the most expensive cars in the world. No joke, Whoa. we got our hands on over $250 million worth of cars. What? One of them even costing $100 million. Nah, man. Okay, I thought he was gonna destroy them like the last video, bro. Okay, okay. I was about to be visibly sad, bro, because that's so much money to destroy. But I don't think he's gonna destroy any of them. He's just gonna, like... First of all, how did you get a car for a dollar, bro? And we're gonna be exploding. No. Sailing. Driving. Oh my gosh, bro. He is ex... <laughs> Why is it always <laughs> the implosions, man? Come on. Dude. And even flying all of these cars to show you why they're so expensive. Starting with this one dollar car. Literally a rust bucket. Why are you selling this car for a dollar? Well, you see, it's pretty much worthless. And I can't put any time or money in this thing. If you grab this dollar. Bro, that's more in scrap metal than worth it than what he's selling it for, man. The deal is final. Now, obviously. Because you know he gave him more just for acting. You know, we gave him more just for showing up in the video. It's you know what I mean, guys? This is a piece of garbage. But when you spend 20k on repairs, it actually runs. Right, what? Let's get this bad boy started. Oh! I did not think it would start. How is this thing driving? Like, <laughs> this is crazy! Wow, he, so he sold a functional car for a dollar, man. What? This is before the repairs, I think, guys. What? Enough. <laughs> Stop. No, Mr. Beast, bro. Come on, man. <laughs> They're trolling, man. What? All right, well, that was the $1 car. Glad I wasn't in that. <laughs> Bring in the $100,000 car, which drives itself. No joke, no one is currently in this car, and it is moving. Let's see what a hundred grand gets you. There's a lot of... Oh, my God. Straight to the Tesla, guys. No ten k, no $100. Straight to hundred k, man. That's way out of my price range. Uh, <laughs> no $1,000 one room in this car this is one of the few cars that can actually fit all my kids do you have kids yeah all of them let's take it for a little spin. <laughs> the real reason you're buying a tesla is because it can drive itself dang t chris has her nails done everything yo all right i'm no longer driving the car oh it's switching lanes it's whoa it is literally driving itself it's my feet are not touching the gas and i'm not touching the steering wheel as i think mr beast regularly has one of these if i'm not mistaken I know I will in the future. I will in the future, guys. Jimmy, are you telling me now you can take a nap while driving? No, don't do that. Oh, okay. <laughs> now, let's see how fast the car can go. Oh! <laughs> it jerks you backwards. That's terrifying. This is just the beginning. Later, we have a car that... 
You made Teslas go pretty fast, guys. That literally transforms into an airplane and flies. But what? Now. Oh. Look at that Lambo. Oh, I almost hit it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I just left the keys in here. How'd nobody steal it? And even though this costs twice as much, it has half oh. as much space. I don't. Guys, I don't think I've ever seen a Lamborghini in person in my life, bro. I don't know if I'd pay 200k for this car because I don't fit in it. Do they even know how to drive a Lamborghini? How do we do Ford? I think you just click the shifter. All right, and now we're on the road. Oh, that sound. Oh my gosh, she sounds angry. Dang, she's got some power. Oh my gosh, this car is insane. I'm barely bro. touching the gas and we're flying. This might be the fastest car I've ever driven. If uh, just an impractical part car, in my opinion. I would not get one. Like those giga rich, like Jack Daugherty, who always seems to, you know, squeeze time into basically bra brag about the Lambo guys. You need to compensate for something. This is definitely the car. And now we are at the three hundred thousand dollar car, and this is supposedly the safest car on the planet. It's like a tank. Is this a military grade car? <laughs> yeah, this is so high up. You were also just in a Lamborghini, to be fair. True, true perspective. <laughs> Let's go over what makes this car so safe. First things first is the bulletproof windows that are this thick. The car is also encased in explosive proof armor that we're gonna put to the test later on. Carl, do you want to press the button? Yeah, safe car then that, though. That, that's super good. I would totally get a safe car. However, I do. I just want auto driving, guys. I, I just chill back and let it drive for me. Uh, so bad. You want to hit the smoke screen button, please? What Whoa. the? Whoa! That is crazy. For what? We have a literally for what? <laughs> Literal smoke screen. Oh my gosh! It smells. So. <laughs> it's so gimmicky, man. Why? Why do they do that? The best part is, none of these features are what make the car really safe. It's the literal explosive proof frame around the car. And we're gonna- That's what I was thinking. We're gonna be the first people to test it. And for reference, before we blow up the $300,000 car, we're gonna blow up a normal car to see if the passengers survive. Three, two, one! And they got a way different, uh, explosion proof uh material this time guys they just got like a freaking what looks like a shower like a window. i forgot what it's called exactly but oh oh snap not only is it on fire but the mannequins literally flew out of the car oh my goodness no man not safe into that thing. it doesn't handle thankfully as regular drivers we don't have to worry about something like this guys Really well at all. And before we blow up this car, I'm gonna put feast tools inside of it. Better protect my. Why? Freaking chop. <laughs> so supposedly this car is explosion proof, but that's never been tested. Let's see if the mannequins. I'm sure they tested it. I'm sure they tested it, guys. Wait, is this something the manufacturer or was it just specially made for the video, guys? Then we'll know. We'll know. And even more importantly, the feastables survive. Three, two, one. Oh! Yo, I think they totally survived it, man. Dude. It just jumped! The car actually survived the blast with only a few minor scrapes. It put a dent in the window. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Where are the Feastables? Chandler, get out the way. Chandler, the Feastables <laughs> survived! If you're looking for a car that can take a bomb, I officially recommend this one. No, no, no. Um... <laughs> There's no link. Are they gonna provide a link to it or something, man? Come on now. <laughs> they didn't even tell us what the Tesla was. But since we're not going to war anytime soon, for only an extra two hundred thousand dollars, um, I had it in my mind. I guess there's gonna be the five hundred K ones next. You can get this five hundred thousand dollar boat car on land. This boat. This is a normal car. You can't really tell the difference. But this is the future of vehicles, guys. Here's the fun part. Just drive it in the water. And it turns into a boat. We're gonna let Carl go first. <laughs> Here we go! Oh, this doesn't feel right. This doesn't feel right. No way, that's so go cool. First, just so I can make sure it works. Are we sinking? No, we're floating. Oh, it looks like it worked. Let's see what happens. Oh my God, we're going. We're driving. Okay, if I was a millionaire, that's totally worth it. In the water. Holy! So you press this until you hear a beep. That's a beep. Now I should be able to drive this like a normal car, but on the water. Tia, hold on. <laughs> I think that's her girl, his girlfriend, guys. Yo, that's the first time I've ever seen. I think maybe his girlfriend on on in a Mr. B's video, guys.
She's like a relatively small streamer, but she has like like beast in the name or something like before. Uh, I don't know, guys. Mr. Beast. That might be her, his girlfriend, guys. Oh, this is incredible. Woo! <laughs> this was literally a car five seconds ago. Yeah. I just want to see them go back on land with it though. They're with them, but I get car sick and boat sick. Oh, we're getting there! Oh! <laughs> whoa! 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 Oh my god! Alright, Carl! 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 Relax. Oh. It doesn't look the, like the most practical thing, guys. First of all, like... Come on now, it's, it does have the space of a boat. A yacht would be cooler. <laughs> They should not have let me drive this. Oh, no. There's no room to really chill and fish or guy, nothing, guys. It's just like a four pat, like, you know what I mean? It had to be a bigger, larger car. <laughs> boat sized car, not this, guys. It's a freaking paddle boat or something. <laughs> Woo! We got him! A very cool idea, and the first time of me actually seeing it, though, so. Oh, they're doing donuts in the water. They're making a whirlpool. I just met this guy five seconds ago. We're gonna race. Three, two, one, go! Oh, he's just so much faster. He's not even trying. Come on, faster! Oh, we're destroyed. <laughs> oh, it's a smoke show! I can't believe we just beat him. This thing goes way too fast. I can't think of a better way to celebrate a win than a festival's bar. Hey! Guys, do you think that is worth 500k? Let me know in the comments below. Lots of festivals. Oh! I wonder how many try If they miss, they probably tried that shot more than once, guys. Hey! Not gonna lie. Hey, I got it. Beesville is the number one chocolate on the planet. If you're not eating it, you should fix that. The fact that all three of us are driving cars on the ocean is insane. Jimmy, I love this thing so much. And the craziest part is, this is just the beginning of this video. The next car on our list can literally fly. And since I'm afraid of heights, I let Carl and Nolan take 600k for that. This one. Oh, Dude, what is happening? It's also my first time seeing something like this, guys. This car is not only completely street legal, but it also has wings that can take it literally 8,000 feet in the sky. There's literally a propeller on that car. Stay here and watch it take off. I'm going to go in that plane and follow it. I just don't believe that this is actually going to fly. It's taking off! The wheels aren't on the ground anymore! It's literally a car that's flying! These cars are getting crazier and crazier. I can't even believe my eyes. There is a car a mile above my head right now. <laughs> that is so awesome, yo. That was so cool. This is the future, bro. Might not... Might be just like in our, you know... Regular standard engine kind of deal. We're not, we're not up there to the in technology. We're not up there to where like you know they could fly without engines and stuff. Yet we'll get there though, guys. Oh, I feel like for six hundred thousand dollars, this is a steal. Up next is the no, one what the million dollar car. But I didn't. That's not how you prepare for landing, bro. What's with the explosions, guys? only bring one of them. As you can imagine, there are a lot of $1 million cars out there. So to make sure I brought your favorite, we got the 10 coolest $1 million cars. And as per usual, we have the entire racetrack to ourselves. So I let my friends choose whatever car they wanted. I'm gonna just ride with you, you pick. Look at this beauty. Am I gonna fit in this? All right, I'll try not to text and drive. It's private property, it's technically legal here. <laughs> oh, here we go. The luxuries of the super rich, man. Jinx it. I feel like I'm in NASCAR. I'm having so much fun. This feels like Fast and Furious. There's just something so masculine about driving overpriced loud cars. On a private racetrack. On a private racetrack. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, I got a set of texts. Might not be the first time they did it, guys. No, I'm kidding. Hey, what's with all the explosions and crashing, bro? I don't know. <laughs> I'm crashing this. Please don't. Car! <laughs> Oh my god, we're doing donuts in a million dollar car! <laughs> and while 
all the games whizzing around the track, I want to show you the next car. This $2 million limited edition hydrogen car. No joke, this car is completely powered by hydrogen and actually exhales drinkable water as exhaust. But the car is still being developed. So this is just a prototype. I don't think I've ever struggled this much to get in a car. Woo. All right, let's see how- Again, if they made it like Tesla, bro, where it's not like, just like extremely expensive and pretty like, you know, affordable, I'd be down. But still, cool for them even developing it, guys. What? Is there no emissions on this? She closes. <laughs> it's taking forever. First impressions, door kind of slow. We're about to turn on the road. This is a really big deal because this car has never been driven on a road before. Oh, you should have told me before I got in. They built this car as a proof of concept, so driving it on the road is questionable. Oh, look at that lady over there. That person over there is... Bro, is he even allowed to do that? Literally filming our car. <laughs> and while we're driving... If I never saw a car like that, I would probably film it before. I mean, but I, I just think it's like one of those fancy supercars. I, I wouldn't know if it was like fuel fish or like a freaking water expelling. I want to tell you about the Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 5 phone. Whoa! And what's special about this phone is it literally folds in half. Boom, half the sun. They got Samsung, guys. You know, they might... They, we're on the town, they actually make more of these sponsors than um, the regular videos, like the regular ad revenue. Also, I'd wear a seatbelt, but it doesn't have one. They haven't gotten that far yet. <laughs> the folding screen on the Flip 5 makes the phone fit in your pocket better and also allows you to use two apps at the same time. Sure, let me show you. Oh, stumble guys this time, guys. I'll stumble guys this time. This time. You. On the bottom half of the phone, I have Google, and on the top half, we're watching a Mr. Beast video. <laughs> oh, snap. Bro, this boy gets up there. Uh, the top half looks like a thumbnail, man. Yeah. Even but they're kind of right. What, what I do like more, though, is our tablet. Like, tablet, like, bigger screen tablet thingy. Even though this car uses hydrogen instead of gas, it still has a range of over a thousand miles in a top speed. Of and also, yeah, I, I would get one, bro. I would get one if I had the cash, man. Of 221 miles per hour. I think those phones are kind of the future, guys. And another cool thing about this phone is it can record in 4K 60 FPS. You can even record while it's folded. In fact, the Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra is the official vlog camera of the channel. Oh, listen to that engine. What? That's such a cool sound. It literally has a front facing camera. Yeah, I'm glad to see, uh, you know, Android take the spotlight here. Because we got Mr. Who's a Boss that just iPhone this, iPhone that, iPhone this, iPhone that. We got Mark, Marquise, iPhone this, iPhone that, iPhone this, iPhone that. Mr. Beast, we got Android with Mr. Beast. Camera, even when you close it down. The Flip 5 is the most innovative phone Samsung has ever made. Click the link in the description to cop one right now. Do it. There's a lot of cars around me and everyone. Get away from my $2 million <laughs> car. I'll see you at the next car. Back at the racetrack, we have the most exotic and powerful car yet. Costing $10 million, this Kunisig What? is the only one in existence. So this is the world's fastest production car? Oh my god. And with literal crushed diamonds in the paint, the insurance companies would only let the owner drive it. That's probably the coolest door I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> You're crazy. All right, let's do this. Do this. this ain't no Batman, bro. It's over the top. Fun fact, I made a grown man cry. Really? Yeah, I scared the crap out of him. <laughs> I'm gonna put my head back so I don't get whiplash. But hey, at least we got somebody designing this. You know what I mean? Did you get a $10 million car? I probably would if I was a billionaire. How is it so fast? <laughs> I've never... One second. <laughs> The reason this car is one of the fastest on the planet is because of its twin turbocharged V8 engine and the fact that its entire frame is made out of air core carbon fiber, making it weigh 500 pounds less than a Lamborghini. I've never witnessed anything like this before. Wonder how fast they're going. No, no speedometer, nothing, guys. <sighs> it's like riding in a roller coaster. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that was awesome. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Let's go hang out with Jay Leno and see what a $20 million car looks like. All right. Jay Leno was the king of the Today <laughs> Show for over 20 years. Yo, they got Jay Leno, man. I think it's Jay Leno, man. Normal other YouTubers, their whole video will be dedicated to Jay Leno. But Mr. BC is so big, it's just like a small portion of his video. 
Let's, let's see if he'll make jokes, guys. I'm, I'm sure he will. Years. Today, he's the proud owner of one of the most impressive car collections in the world, including this $20 million... You know, bro has a whole show dedicated to his, like, garage, man. McLaren F1. Did, did it just start doing that because of you? It's high tech. <laughs> Robbers, don't try that. And what makes it so valuable? It's a V12, carbon fiber. It's extremely light, and it was 241 miles an hour, which is still Dang. the fastest for a non- What the heck? Turbocharged, not supercharged car. I'll show you something kind of cool. I got three seats, as you can see. Wow. Wait, we got cars going that fast nowadays? Nah. The car is about 2,300 pounds. Your most modern cars are 4,000. It's more comparable to Nolan's mom than another car. That's right, exactly. In fact, Nolan's mom was really the one they used as the benchmark. You guys want to go for a ride? Uh, of course. There's no way getting in that middle seat is actually comfortable. Oh, it's not bad. <laughs> yeah, it's not bad. It does not look bad at all. It's comfortable. <laughs> It's oddly comfortable to have three seats like this. Yeah, it is pretty interesting. As normally, this is... <laughs> three seats, guys. I've never seen this three-seater. Exactly. Or, or if you were in England, this is where this would be a bit. That's right. Yeah. right. You can be in England, you can be in America. <laughs> How old <laughs> did you have this car? What year were you born? Man, I'm excited to see cars in the future, guys. 10, 20 years down the line. 1998. Actually, I think we'll get, we'll get uh, in good places there. I got this in 98. I popped out of my mom and he's like, you know what, let's celebrate by buying this That's car. That's right, and here's the second part. I'm your dad. Oh. <laughs> oh. Interesting. How much did you buy this for? I paid 800000 Wow. And I bought it and people thought, oh, you'll never get your money back. But then it just went up and up and up and up. And now they're $20 million, you know, so it's it's crazy. This car basically made you a million dollars a year every year you've owned it. I guess that's fair to say, yeah. Carl, what do you think of the car? <laughs> What's stopping yeah. you from buying one? Jay Leno is so rich, man. Um, $19.9 million. <laughs> Have you ever had a wreck? Oh, yeah. Have I've you? had a lot of wrecks. Holy so smokes. Nope. Problem, guys. That was perfect. These next two cars are so expensive that they are literally locked. <laughs> no jokes from Jay Leno. He's like, yo, I'm tired of making jokes. I did that for so long in my career. I don't know, guys. Away in the museum at all times. Combined, they cost eighty million dollars, and somehow we convinced the museum to give us the cars. Looking good. And this is where the video gets literally mind blowing. Crank this bad boy up. Oh, That's wow. the thirty miller. Let's hear the fifty miller. Not gonna lie, I like the fifty million dollar one a little better. So I jumped in the fifty million dollar car with Donut Media, and Chandler got in the thirty million dollar car with Bo Bachman. The car. Bro, I just hope I make 50 million by the time I, I retire, man. Gosh darn. Our legend. You ready? Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's do this. The reason the car that Chandler is in is so expensive is because it was specifically constructed as a gift from the founder of Ferrari to the founder of Ford. This is the only version of this Ferrari ever made in human history. Oh, watch out for this bump. No scrapage. Okay, you don't really notice how like crappy the street is until you drive something that's $50 million. <laughs> the car we're in is the most expensive Jaguar in existence. It was the legendary actor Steve McQueen's daily driver, and he got so many speeding tickets driving it that his license was actually suspended. I'm noticing every single pothole now. And because these cars are so expensive, we have an entire police escort dedicated to making sure nobody comes close to the car. Jeez, man. I, I would just think it's like an old style car worth like maybe like 20k or something. 30 million, man. That's so much, brothers. So much. This is insane. Hey, get some speed. Uh, how's it drive? Beautifully. Woo! Oh, my hat! Oh, well. <laughs> and while we were all having fun, Bo Bachman pushed the $30 million car to its absolute limit. Hold on. Sure, it doesn't wait, even wait, go wait. that fast. Hold on. Hold on, uh -oh. the car stopped. Hold on one second. We hit it too too hard. <laughs> the $30 million... Bro, you broke a $30 million car, man. What is... Oh, my goodness. Our car stalled. We're gonna hop out of these things before we break them. Let's go drive the $100 million world's first Ferrari. Most people would imagine a $100 million car would look something like this. But you'd be surprised to find out. Not yet, guys. Not yet. That this is the $100 million. Bros, bro. It looks like a prop car, bro.
Man, that, that car they're showing right there, not even, it's priceless. We don't have anything like it. The, the car they were proposing, you know what I mean? Dollar car. This car is so historic and valuable that this museum representative is the only person on earth allowed to drive it. It's only allowed to be driven on this bridge. We had cops completely close the roads and we even had street cleaners fill in every pothole and clean the entire street to ensure that nothing damages this $100 million car. This is gonna be crazy! All right, and now we're on the bridge! Why is it always the classic cars worth the most, guys? Bridge! Oh my gosh. Look at that. $100 million barreling down the street. Only bees can sit in it, man. Street. Oh, I keep losing my hat. He lost his hat. <laughs> That's the second time. Most expensive car comes with a free hat. Come on. Come on. This is awesome. They have one thing more fun than this. All right. Floor it. Let's go. Oh my god, this is I'm legit underwhelmed. Awesome! I'm legit underwhelmed. What a... It's just a collectible. Not practical. I'd rather get a, a new... Uh, I'd rather get a new car, man. I, I'd sell it and buy, like, just a new car. A Tesla, really. Guys, enjoy the video! Let's drop a nuke on the bridge! With the other cars, the Tesla, that was cool. The the the, the fast cars Jay Leno had, those were cool. Pretty cool video. Shout out, Mr. Beast. Like, comment, subscribe. Can we borrow the car to film overnight in the world's most expensive car? Who's this, bro? Who's this? Overnight challenge? Who? who? It is. It is. Whatever. <laughs> sorry. Sorry. Like, comment, subscribe. Check out the original video in the description. Thank you for watching.